just get lost in my own head whenever I'm whenever I'm waiting for something to do. Anyway. That works. Oh, he tries to summon a friend. Oh, okay. Oh, I wanted to go up. Okay. Thanks, game. We really shouldn't be doing this. It feels wrong to be here. Zebe, didn't your people tell stories about this place? They did. The elders say that something truly evil is sealed in this mountain. Eh, most legends about ancient evils are overblown anyway. Half the legends where I'm from are just about me and Bong. As long as we're careful and stick together, we'll be all right. Won't we? I know you're all worried, but I have to do this so my father can pass safely into the next life. You don't have to come with me, but I'm going on. I'm gonna chop his head off. You settled on chopping, eh? I have. I will follow you to repay my debt for your earlier kindness. I'm honor-bound to do it. But I cannot say I approve of this course. Yes, we must be mindful. Ravanavar's remaining forces seem to be more concentrated here as well. It's okay, I'll just ask some questions. Every single question. Axed. I didn't see that. We're just gonna slow you way down. Huh, she went splat. Also, that's something. What is that? Well, I can't find out what it is. Oh. Well, yeah, I can't do anything up here, can I? Oh, wait. Bo. Missed. Why have it there then? Uh oh. Just make sure you can't do anything. Okay, whatever, he's fine. Maybe. What is sounding like an episode? Oh. I was about to ask what, but then it's like, oh, right, this game. No, don't do anything. Okay, now we do something. There, triple debuff. Let's go. Yeah, 
Make sure the, the... Okay, yep. That's what we do. Yep, I thought that was going to be a bad idea. It just seems like I could do it. Maybe that's a return point. I'm gonna hope that's a return point anyway. <laughs> Gather them up. And then make sure they can't do anything. And make sure they can't do anything again. That means there's like a secret one. There's a secret arrow spot somewhere out here. What if I shoot this twice? Okay, never mind. I tried. Oh god. <laughs> I'll leave it be. For now. Well, you know, reward for exploration to some degree. Hold on, I'm just gonna let everybody charge up. For the most part. Wrong button. A rude. Secondly, am I going a backwards way? I think I'm going a backwards way. Because I don't have the ability to go forward at that point. Thank you. 
There we go. And make sure they stay hexed. So yeah, uh, just by the like the appearance of this location, I think I am going to get an ability here soon that'll allow me to make backtracking somewhat easy. Holy cow! Really? What? Okay, but I'm not touching that. But I'm not touching that. Game. Do you see where I'm touching? It's it's not there. Despite what you might think, I'm not touching there. Okay, fine. Then no, I guess I cannot go up there. Fine, you can have your victory for half a minute. Hold that thought while I go in my, inside my head. And I would like to be a defensive man. So, he wants 10, she wants 20. Okay. Whatever. Do you still say, get angry? Oh. They're just, they're just chilling. What if I shoot it? I can't shoot it. Aha, uh -huh. hello, optional, optional man. Okay, Tungar. Have fun. I'm leaving my head. Dar's at negative 15 now, so it means he likes us, he'll like us soon. To some extent. Barring that the plot basically is going to make that happen. Listen. Don't be a rocket scientist. You don't have to be a rocket scientist to understand that he hates us to start with, but he's going to like us by the time we get to the end of this game. Got it! Nothing up there, dang it. No. And you can just hold on to everything you're about to do. Oh, I hit your buddy.
Yeah, it's just, it is like, like that weird seamless transition between platformer, then RPG fighter that has like complicated. Yeah, I missed. I want you down here and now fighting me. You're up there. Oh, you cannot fight on those platforms. Alright, I have an idea. To make it so I can fight him. Idea dying. Come down here. Can I really not fight anything or do anything I wish to do? Keep going. No, get down here. I missed him. I missed him. I want to fight him. Fight me, you coward. I hit him. I know I hit him. Bullseye. Get down here. What is this game's issue? There. Now we're fighting him. I feel like I'm not supposed to be fighting on this. Oh! Okay. No, 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 that's not how this works. We're not going to play games like this. We're going to fight this way instead. Make sure he can't... Oh, he's high up. Can't hit. Get him. She's fine. She's fine. See? I told you. She's fine. Oh. Oh, he is strong boy, okay. Okay.
I was surprised I reacted in time for that. Something else gotta get a turn in. Really? Yes, there we go. That is a hell of a fight. I'm glad I went through that effort. That was like, that felt like it was supposed to be a boss. But now I also feel like I was actually probably not supposed to fight it until I like make a trip two through here or something dumb like that. I wanted to fight it. I'm allowed to fight it. No, do not. Do not. There. Go Rosmi. I feel I'm learning the combos better. Like I'm still experimenting. I'm definitely still experimenting, but I'm feel I feel like I'm getting the combos better now. No, those stay up. There was something in here, wasn't there? Okay, there wasn't. Good to know I'm only slightly paranoid. Oops. Really? Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. He'll be fine. I don't care much for you. Uh, he dead. Fixing it though. I don't think I've ever fought one of these. Freezing just to be safe. Ah, that's a lovely screen cap. Just, uh, I want you to take in that lovely image of Razmi right there. <clears throat> Also, Ladybug. Ladybug flies. Just, uh, enjoy that image. If I don't forget about it, I will enjoy that image later. Mm, that's not the play. That's the play. Okay. And let's text. I'm a genius. Geniuses do that. Alright. 
Let me go. Okay, there's nothing I can do up there. Christ alive! Could that be any more difficult? Uh, it's fine. I hand. I got this. It's fine. I got this. I'm amazing at video games. Okay, I may have lied for half a minute. Okay, I can't do anything against that wall. Wait, how many hours did it say I was playing? I really hope it didn't say 27, because I've not been playing this game for 27 hours, unless my friend left it running in the background while he was playing it. Your strength has carried you here. To think, after all my efforts, after all these years of breaking once proud warriors, you were the only one I needed. I don't want to hear any of that stuff. I just want to avenge my father. You aren't the least bit curious about your past? Where you truly come from? Well, no matter. It saves me explaining. Now, follow me, child. And we'll plunge the world into darkness. Arrow. Wait. Lord Ravanovar, I must ask you. I've always considered you the father I never had. You raised me and taught me right from wrong. You always said you wanted a world of peace. Quiet yourself, boy. I suppose I must have scooped you off the streets because you had a fair amount of eating. But compared to this girl, you are nothing. World of peace? Of course. The only peaceful world is one without humanity. Be gone with you! Now, girl, let us resume. No talking! I'm coming for your head! Ravonavar! Oh, she actually got the head. Oh! What? That's not pleasant. Nice hook. Does it come in men's? And do one of these. Yeah, we'll need a heal. Do not touch Rouse me. Do not touch him either. Whew. Whoa. 
Okay, we're we, we Mar we're Mario brothers now. We Mario. Hold on. Full. Gonna take more than that to stop me from doing doing poorly at platforming. Ah, oh, damn it! All right. Well fought, young one. I almost had to try. Now about that monster we were discussing earlier. In truth, the divine being known as Kala is sealed here. Kala? She's the maker and destroyer of worlds! Almost correct. She was sealed here by Ajna's own father, Ender, and three of his ambitious friends. Oh yes, Ajna. I know about your father. Dad did that? I see you don't know him as well as I. No matter. Wouldn't you like to see for yourself? There you go, get some hexes on him. Please, no. I don't think he likes me. Considering I've already done two thirds of his health and it's felt like nothing. Ah. Well, that wasn't the play. This is the play. It's fine. Walk it off, Ajna. Oh god, Ajna, you can't walk that off. He's here. To me, I was merely your plaything. Well observed, child. But your angst will not help you. This world will be destroyed. Won't you die along with it? Why would you do that? But I long to see the end of this world. This has been my life's goal. To begin the world anew and create a paradise. And I shall be gloriously reborn. Millennials, am I right? Why you think I'm gonna help you, but I'm not letting you break that seal. Throw all the heads you want. Stop that. Yeah, he'll be dead. Haha, -ha, perfect guard. Oops, oh well. <laughs> Fine heal. Down you go. 
Dang. You actually have to lead up with somebody who has a multi-hit. I had no idea if I had control at that point or not. Yes. This is it. Break free. Come I think an oopsie happened. Wakey, wakey. What? Who are you? Why am I all wet? My name is Torani. I revived you with the water of life. Your... Is that your hair? Of course. Is there a problem? Oh, um, no. Sorry. <laughs> Just, where am I? How, how did I get here? Don't you remember? Oh, my poor wounded bird. I guess... I guess I don't. Then I will tell you what I saw. You flew across the Almuta Desert from the direction of Mount Sumeru and landed practically at my feet. I brought you back to my cave and I've been looking after you ever since. Oh, that's so kind. Think nothing of it, Luke Sao. I could feel your pain. You could feel it? What does that mean? I feel the joys and sufferings of all the world. It's my power and my curse. Oh, I'm sorry if I hurt you. I was having these terrible nightmares. No, no, I didn't mean it like that. Healing others is one of my greatest joys. Still, if you're feeling everyone's pain, you must be really strong. Hmm. I might be. In a couple thousand years, you can get used to anything. Thousand? Yes, we Deva do live quite a long time by human standards. But we were expelled from Mount Sumeru 16 years ago, as you just were. At first, I hoped you might be one of us. But you're so much cuter than any Deva. Like a precious doll. I just want to eat you up. Please, no. <laughs> I'm not that cute. You are, you are. Well... Can you help me figure out what happened? You say I came out of Mount Sumeru. I think something happened there, but my brain is so cloudy, I just can't remember. Your memory will return, I'm sure of it. You have been sleeping for three days. You just need more time to recover. Days? Then where is everybody else? I only found you, Luxo. Oh no, my cloudy brain. They must still be stuck inside. Ugh, Ajna. It's about time you woke up. We were stuck in here. Bomb and I were so bored. 
Do let us out before we lose our own minds. Oh my! I'm sorry, everyone. What happened? You don't remember? We fought Ravonavar. You chopped his head off. He grew more heads. Chop, chop. You turned blue and got all spiky. You had all these eyes. It was disgusting. It was the best thing I ever saw. <laughs> oh. I changed somehow, didn't I? It's like you became a different person. I've never seen anything like it. And Ravanavar? I don't think anyone could have survived that blast at such close range. You know, when you broke Kala's seal? Kala? Oh, right. What happened to her? We don't know. We all got sucked into your inner realm and blasted off the mountain with you. But it didn't look good. At least Ravanavar is gone. But Kala! If she has broken free, that weight is on our shoulders. So that's what that surge of energy was. Kala has awakened. You know about Kala too? It was Kala who expelled the Deva from Mount Sumeru when she made it her home. <sighs> so who's this lady? Oh, that's right. This is Tarani. She took care of me. Hello, everyone. I'm so pleased to meet you all. Thank you again. Oh, and I'm Achna. A sensitive young woman with a high amount of itty and a troubled past. I can sense it. I know more about you than you might expect. Creepy. I think I need to try to piece this all together. You were blue and horrifying. It was the most awesome thing I've seen. That was fascinating and terrifying. I'm sorry. Don't be. We're botanists, but we're interested in all sciences. And you might be one of the greatest scientific discoveries of all time. Think of it. Harnessing the power of Kala. But I'm not Kala. I'm still me. I think. Oh, of course, of course. But if we figure out where that power of yours comes from, think of everything we could do. Even if it's from Kala, you can control it and use it for good. Well, hi, Dar. He was like a father to me. And he cast me away. And he turned into a monster right before my eyes. How did things turn out this way? Oh, hey, Ajna. So I was... blue? You were blue. But now you're not. Honestly, it's kind of disappointing. I'm sorry? <laughs> Zebe, you seem like you have something to say? I'm not sure how to talk to you now. Who or what are you? Are you even the girl we knew before? I am! That's hard to believe. Not a lot of girls I know change into monsters when they get angry. Know a lot of girls, do ya? What? No, I, I mean, yes, but not like that. <laughs> anyway, Ajna, if you have some relationship to Kala, none of us should even be associating with you. I don't have anything to do with Kala. Or, I don't think I do. I guess, I don't really know. Why, okay, why? Why is Rosmi the best person in this game? Why? I never expected I'd be trapped inside another human. It's a good thing we don't have to eat while we're there. Or poop. <laughs> Fill your brain with poop, Ajna. Rosmi! <sighs> I can't. I actually can't. Rosby! Don't st you're not scared of me? Oop, I skipped dialogue. Nah, I live with a giant bird. The odd blue lady here and there doesn't mean much to me. <laughs> Thanks, Kushi. I'm talking to everybody, but uh Even if you are I already forgot her name. Ajna, this is the situation we're in. You woke up Kala. 
And as a protector, I failed to stop you. I didn't know all that would happen. That doesn't change the result. By all rights, I should turn you into the authorities. I am the authorities now. You know Dar was in there with me, right? Just sulking and pouting like a dumb idiot baby. Ugh, that sounds like torture. It was. If you trap me in your brain again, I'm setting you on fire. I think that's fair. <laughs> Rosby! Goddamn! Maybe if we find Kala, I can become a full-fledged protector. Maybe if we... Okay, she's done. I'm sorry. I have to think. You can augment your strength with ring cells. Like fuel for Ravanovar's fortress. The energy solutions alone boggle the mind. But what if I explode or something? Then your guts will be everywhere. Yeah, what about that? I don't think that's gonna happen. Probably. Um, I'll make sure it doesn't happen. With science. I'm sorry if all this makes you uncomfortable. I'm nervous too. But it's exciting, isn't it? You're finding out so much new stuff about yourself. I guess. Just give me a minute, will ya? I need some space. It was cramped in there. That's a lie. It's very large in there. Okay, well, he's done. Are you done? I'm sorry if all this but Okay, she's done. So now we talk to now we talk to her. inside a monster brain now they all hate me I don't think you're a monster and they wouldn't have survived that blast alone you probably saved their lives but isn't it weird that I've been absorbing people it's not that unusual there are Deva and other creatures whose itty is augmented by others but I don't want to be a creature <laughs> you are too charming Luke so everyone I don't really understand what's happening with me. How did I get so strong? I was so angry. And did I release Kala? Is she free now? What does that even mean? It means we're gonna die. For once I agree with the witch. Kala's power is released and you are the one who released it. It means doom for this world. But I didn't mean to. Maybe you didn't. But you allowed yourself to be tricked by Ravanovar and did it just the same. What's more, he said your power was the same as Kala's. If that's true, you're a danger to all of us. I'm not dangerous. I don't think... I mean, I'm still me. Are you? That's a little harsh, Zebe. Frankly, I think I'm letting her off easy. Because of Ajna, I failed in my duties as a protector, and so have you, Kushi. We were meant to guard Sumeru. And now the worst imaginable thing has happened there, right in front of our faces. Even if Ajna did break this seal, as you say, I'm sure she didn't know what she was doing. Well, that's exactly the problem, though, isn't it? If she wields this strength without knowing where it's from or how to control it, she could destroy us all. Hmm. I suggest we all part ways now and leave Ajna to her own fate. You would abandon a young girl in the middle of the desert? What kind of person would do that? Wait, everyone! Listen to the wind outside! We couldn't split up now even if we wanted to. That's a sandstorm out there. None of us will be able to make it through by ourselves. This is all my fault. I'm gonna find a way out of here. It's the least I can do. Ajna, it's dangerous. Sorry, I have to try. I'm sorry. I have to think. Wait, did I just, I have three. I have three bars of ED, also Dar's in my head.
Rosie wins every time. She's very good at this game. Idea! Damn. Idea failed. Well? Ginseng was right. The storm won't let us through. I'm sorry. <laughs> Tarni, isn't there some other way out of here? Maybe. But that depends on you. We will need to awaken this power of yours. No! I mean, I'm not sure I want to. I will help you, Luke Sao. We can do it together. Torani, you're so nice. It seems our fates are linked. Good. Okay, Torani's on the team. So she is a dedicated healer. It would seem. But I'm going to stick with this party I have right now. So what do I do? You must meditate. Focus. Let go. Feel the strength flowing from your core out through each limb and beyond. Feel your life force flow from your heart and through your veins. From your chest to your arms to your fingertips. From your center to your legs and toes. <sighs> the energy within you is augmented by your experience, by the people you know. The power of the world binds this energy within. I... Concentrate and let go. Oh. Uh, I can't hold it for long. You'll get better with time. Even if it's for a short while, you can use this power to dash into the wind. I'm going this way now. Hi, right, Farf. Okay then. Okay, that's the extent of her power of our power now. Whoa, it worked. It's not as scary as I thought. Maybe for you. Scared, huh? That's not that, that's not what I mean. Now that we're out, I suggest we head to Port Maritha. You should stick with Ajna until then. I suppose we have no choice. Right. Once you can get to the port, you can decide whether you'll help Ajna along her journey or leave her to die like common beasts. Uh... Tarani? Tarani? Really? I'll get us out of here first. Tarani? Well... Well, at least there's a form of fat weight.
Why do I feel like that was... Interesting. So, what's bothering you? Oops, I guess you can tell what I'm thinking, huh? I can certainly tell what you're feeling. Maybe it will help to talk about it. I don't know, I just feel weird. Why did I get this power and I'm basically holding all these people hostage inside my brain? I'm not their chief or leader or anything like that. I'm just someone who happened to absorb them. I just wanted to avenge my dad, and now everything's all strange. You feel shame because of the death of your father, guilt for your role in breaking Kala's seal, and fear because of your growing power. But all growth is painful, Ajna. What if this growth gets everyone killed? Hmm. If Kala has indeed awakened... Because of me. Because of you, perhaps. But if she has awakened, someone will have to stop her. And far from getting everyone killed, your new strength might be the only thing that can save everyone. Ugh, that's so much pressure! The world won't end if I just... go home, will it? I can't say. We need to learn more about Kala's awakening. Then you can make that choice. How did I get into this situation? Making life or death choices for other people? You may not want to be a leader. But power attracts power, for better or for worse. You can use that power, or you can let it use you. That is your choice, Luxal. Well, that was oddly poetic. Okay, can't go back. Oh, that initiates. I like how they have it set up so it's just like ultimate temptation to constantly be charging. Okay, that's a one way. Therapeutic. Wait, hold on. I can cheese I can cheese an achievement. Hold on. I'm gonna cheese an achievement right now. I hope at least. There's an achievement to get a 100 hit combo. Anyway, so I can look at this screen while I do this. How's it going, guys? I feel like the game is really loud. At least the audio readout makes it look like it's really loud. Thank you. 
All right, I'm gonna focus on real time. Ah. So, volume's down low. Got it. Okay. And... 100. Ah. Hold on, I gotta look at these achievables now. Oh, 108. It also says in battle, so. Oh well. We'll never know now. Uh. I let go of B a long time ago. Get another text. Okay, no, it's just the same text I've got to remind me that I have my appointment tomorrow. Nothing. Oh, I was supposed to do that. Hey, there's someone over there. They don't look so good. Water, please. Here, child. Let me offer you some water from my hair. That's not what you want to hear. Gross. Gross. Thank, thank you so much. I thought I was going to die out here. My throat feels so much better. My hair sustains life. It is far more nourishing than regular water. So gross. <laughs> Shush, Razmi. What are you doing out in the middle of the desert anyway? I am called Kadira. I was following the Imperialist Army of the Iron Kingdom, but I lost them in the sandstorm. Iron Kingdom, huh? They have been a scourge upon my people. Their armies have been taking more and more territory under the guise of protection. My brother was fighting to defend our land, but went missing some months ago. One of our warriors returned with his sword and cape, which I carry now. So you're gonna beat these guys up with your brother's sword? I will not use it until I can return it to him. I can defeat them using my shield alone. Whoa, that's so cool. Where'd you learn to fight with a shield? My grandmother taught me over many years using a basket as practice. Women among my people aren't allowed to fight, but she trained me in secret since I was a child. Wow, just like me, kinda. When his sword was returned to us, I hid my face behind this wrap to avoid detection and left the village. I fear he is dead, but I must find out the truth. I was tracking a troop of Iron Kingdom soldiers when the sandstorm hit. I believed they entered the temple, but as you can see, I didn't quite make it that far. Right. We'll help you. Weren't we heading straight for Marifa? But... More dead weight. This is the first thing you want to say since Sumeru? Come now. We've gotten into enough trouble already. You rush in to help anyone you see. And you only speak up to add something negative. She wants to avenge her brother. I can relate to that, if you get my meaning. 
Anyway, children, the only way to Marifa is through the temple, so we may as well let her accompany us. There's strength in numbers. I would welcome her. I want to see under your mask. Is your face all weird? Do you have no lips? Let me see. My, my lips are perfectly standard, I'll have you know. I'll believe it when I see it. Let's just take a quick peek. No! Fine, fine. Well, come along anyway. Ajna's gonna absorb you no matter what anybody says. <laughs> Welcome, no lips. <laughs> I have lips. Please stop talking about them. Anyway, we must be wary. People say the temple was suddenly abandoned. Oh, that would explain these markings. It looks like sandworms. Ooh, sandworms. Ajna, can I keep one? Just one little thing for old Rosmi. Well, if we have to go through here anyway, no big deal, right? Nice. Yeah, time to find out what a sandworm is. Uh-oh. I stand ready. Uh, all right. Well, that's the temptation I did not need offered. Somebody who uses a shield. You're really gonna make me do this, aren't you? Hold on, I wanna go down here yet. Ugh, looks like we can't get through this way after all. I'm certain there's a way below. Though it may not be easy. situations than this. We'll find a way. No. Okay. So it's like every time you imp do an input for her, you hit up, and, the and then she will make an automatic follow-up attack, which is really weird to get used to. That's dumb. It is like pixel perfect timing pretty much. Oh. Never mind. Oh. 
That's a sandworm. Hey, bitch. See, I'm not sure how I feel about this because Tuskar was, or uh, yeah, Tuskar was great for like grouping up enemies together. But Kidara is fun because I just get to, I just get to, I just get to play Mario Party One when she attacks. Those unlocked. <sighs> you dropped a whole man's on me. It takes all my ED to resurrect. Okay, that makes more sense. Okay, I'm, I'm following it up more. I'm understanding now. Somebody wants to perish. Somebody still wants to perish. Alright, I was going back up. Leaving. That's an important room. I can't go back up the way I want to. Is that a... Huh. Interesting. Ah! Okay, so I'm not allowed to go to that half of the temple, for now at least.
Oh, I see it. Okay. So you do have to, you kind of have to mash the B button, but anytime I keep, I'm going to mess up her name, Party. Quadira, anytime she does an attack, it's like you have to, anytime you input an attack for her, you have to hold up, and then you have to hold up in the attack and mash the attack button for her to follow up. So again, I'm not 100% certain if I like her or Tuzgar more, because Tuzgar groups everybody together. She just has a lot of follow-up attacks that require technical input. But they have the same stat loadout. from my bow then no zebe i'll do it as you like but don't expect this to win me over he looks like a hero the ravanovar just based on the uh brute she's wearing he she all right There we go. Just... There we go. Oh, that's not a bash enough. Move. Oh, okay. So they controlled the worm. Eventually he'll lighten up. I say hopefully. Okay, so she's very good at breaking guards. That's her thing. She, oddly enough, the person with the shield can break a guard incredibly easily.
I just get Omega hugged. Break anything. Bring it on. We we escape command grabs now. Okay, arouse me does not escape command grabs. Oh, you don't like hexes. attack. Hello, I'm a jelly. You will fall. One day I will protect everyone. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, if I shoot another arrow in there, it'll go like here. Was it kind of a spontaneous thing, or did, was it something else? Oh, come off now. Come, come off it. Oh, come off it! I'm gonna slap you in a second here. Well, this isn't death-defying at all, no. Nope, I'm figuring out better. Okay, I'm still figuring this out better. Hold on. I've been grabbed. Command grabs. Perfectly timed. What are you talking about? Bad timing. <laughs> I timed that. I don't want to hear it. Th they're not good hugs. Okay, we need heals. Hold on, someone's trying to be cute. I am so glad. Well, Dar's negative nine now, which is better than where we started off with. Oh my gosh, it's a little bun bun.
move. Really? You're gonna do one of these? Nah. Bad puppy. Yeah. Get out there and fight. No, I want the guy the guards. There, he gonna be slow. There, break the guard. You know what? Bad puppy. Bad puppy! I want you to just... Soak up that screenshot for a minute. No, I don't want to do that. I want to do a normal jump. Okay. I have three of the gems I need. Okay. That was almost the one and done. That doesn't count? Bonkus. Hi. Just how long is this thing? Judging by its diameter, I'd say it's quite long. Ginseng and honey, please. Huh. Yeah, they are science of Ravanovar. Wait. There's something back there I missed. Looks like I can go back to other places now. Also, sorry, Mama Jelly. Can't get can't can't hit the nut button. It's currently packed up. Really? So do I have to hit the button again? 
it's currently yeah the button oh I can't I can't return at all but yeah the button is packed up and about 10 miles away so I cannot push it until I am fully moved into my new place which is Saturday which hey I'm gonna put up a proposition because it's probably a boring idea but it could be a nice thing to do for an IRL stream uh, what if I ha what if I had a stream on Saturday after I'm all done moving that is just me finishing putting everything together in my room. Again, depending upon how quickly I get everything set up. I get my computer set up at least to stream. Huh, really? Bashing jumped that whole time. I don't know. It just seems kind of like a dumb thing, but it also seems like a fun thing just because, you know. I know, I realize not everybody is all about, like, you know, IRL streams all the time. Jump! Okay, I got it. Yeah, I realize not everybody's always all about IRL streams, but I mean, it just seems like something I can do where I can quote unquote waste time, but also be impactful to everything going on or be like, you know, actually stream stuff still while doing what I'm supposed to be doing responsibly, quote unquote responsibly. That is if the internet is set up when I get out to, uh, when I do get out to my new place. Okay, there's actually wind current stopping me up there. I feel like we're back before where we started. That thing's gonna be mad as soon as it comes out of the ground. Wait, here we are again. I think I've been given a second chance at some of this stuff. Well, I never did... S <sighs> Responsible-ish. Okay, no, I have to go way above that. So let me take the lower path this time and figure out what's going on down below. There. And now he's stunned. There, hexed. Here comes the boom. Oh! So that's how you do that. Good to know. So you said 10, 20, and... Yeah, you said 20 and 10. 
Okay, that's all I wanted. Aha! I can eventually reach that. Oh, I was supposed to go up. Hold on, can I? Can I actually just load this and try again? Oh wait, this is before I did all this the first time. Well, we get to redo a fight now. Okay. I think I see how this works. Hold on. You ready for this? Christ alive! A straight up Kamehameha to bitch. Okay, hold on. Stop. Damn it. I don't want to... There's something up there. I want it. I will actually save it at a proper time this time, but I want it so bad. And a bunch of hexes and puppies are pretty much boned. Really? That is straight up an enemy deletion. Okay, go back and save now.
I actually could not jump up again after that. Okay, that's dumb. Never mind. That is not something possible. At least as far as I can tell, and the game will let me do. Oh, there's a ring cell up there. I actually meant to load higher up, but this works. Yeah, I'm just gonna... Something about that is not sitting right with me. It feels like I should be able to do it. I want to try something. Okay, no, you can't. You cannot do a super mit you cannot do a super Metroid shine spark. Unless nope, can't do it that way either. Yeah, it actually will not let me jump like it will actually not let me jump up or hit that again. And the arrow does nothing. Okay, I'm going to let that one be then. I will keep that save in case somebody's like, oh, you can definitely do the thing if you do the, 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 the thing. Plus, well, there's also this part of the game where it feels like it's not everything is opened up to me yet. That slayer is not the other side of the wall. Okay, I tried to just be fancy that one. Okay, you can dunk them before the battle even initiates. Get him. Get him, Dar. You're not allowed to act. Ah, 
the thing again. Okay, he has audio cues, that's how. Would you stop being a coward? Come here. Get him, Dar. to get the X hit in. Oh, I killed him with that. going to face the Iron Kingdom. Oh, well, I kind of know how you feel. My dad just died. Dar killed him. Dar did? Mm -hmm. How could you? It was... I, I was under orders. <laughs> a fine excuse. Ravanovar raised me since I was a child. I didn't... I, I didn't know. Frankly, I don't know how you can all stand each other. Break it up, children. I'll not have you fighting until we reach the port. <laughs> Kadira, don't worry. We'll figure this out together. I'm gonna put this in a separate slot, but oh my gosh, that, fu that fight was awesome. And everything kind of leading up to that fight was amazing. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a double axe swing. That's really all I can say about that right now. Did I? I really just circumnavigated an entire section. Okay. That's an oasis. I've already gotten to Tahini. What? Okay, what is your name again? Tarani. I am so bad with her name. Oh, I'm almost, I've almost filled safe slots. Yeah, we don't need to go back to the beginning. Here it is, Fort Marifa, the gateway to the world. Huh, for a gateway, I thought it would be bigger. We can get ships here, that's the main thing. Right, about that. What does everyone want to do? I dragged you into all this, and none of you owe me a thing. <sighs> it's okay, Zebe. I appreciate everyone's help, but we're through the sandstorm now. None of you have to stay. 
But I need to figure out what this Kala thing means. Find out about my own power. I... I don't even know all the stuff I need to figure out. Ajna, you are the grossest, most disgusting person I've ever met in my life. Everything around you turns into a disaster. I... I guess you're right. So, obviously, I'm coming with you. Bomb is too. He has to come because he's mostly dead. Aren't you, you little idiot? Oh, thanks, Ryan. Good boy, Bomb. <laughs> Am I thanking you after that? Whatever floats your boat, buddy. You saved me in the desert. You said you'd help me find out what happened to my brother. I'm coming. Eh. But you leave me alone, Rosmi. No worries. <laughs> Rosmi! Well, this is a lot more dangerous than I expected, but you can't become a world famous botanist without some risk. So, I'm coming. As am I. You still haven't fully recovered, and you need a guide as your power grows. And someone to buy you cute dresses and do your hair. What's wrong with my hair? Oh, absolutely nothing. Just for fun. Didn't your mother ever fix your hair? I didn't really know my mother. <gasps> no. Well, an Almushan braid would look lovely for starters. <laughs> well, thanks everyone. I really appreciate your help. Oh, but Zebe? Right. I want no further part in destroying the world, thanks. I've done enough to help the charade. I'm with you only until we find a boat. Well, where protector goes, so too must I. I understand. I'll make sure everyone who wants to stay finds a boat. How's that? Fine by me. Wait, may I speak? Better make it good. This is the big who stays and who goes conversation. And I'd prefer that you go. I know. I know most of you don't like me. And you have good reason. I did kill Ajna's father. I thought I was doing it for the good of the world, but Ralanavar had blinded me. He raised me since I was a boy, and he spoke so lovingly of the new world he would create. I had no idea he meant to destroy it first, and I had no idea the deeds, acts we committed were done in the name of destruction. How did you not know killing innocent people was wrong? I was told they were blasphemers against the gods, but in truth, I have no excuse but you. And yet you are younger than I and committed no such atrocities. Ravonovar told me the heretics we dispatched would be reincarnated in paradise and live a better life, but I had never stayed behind after a battle. I'd never had to see the consequences until now. Apologizing isn't enough. I took someone precious to you, and I can never bring him back. Please, Ajna. Let me offer my services to you as penance. You don't have to like me. I don't. But let me be your sword. I have no purpose. I have nowhere to belong. Please, I don't want to become some mercenary for hire. I know I'm asking even more of you, but I want to try to do something good. Let me help you save this world from destruction. Well, don't do it. He's the worst. Yeah, he is. But maybe he deserves a chance. For what it's worth, he is being sincere. I'm... I'm gonna consider it. But listen, Dar. From now on, you're listening to me. And if we find someone who needs help, we're helping them. No discussion. I am yours to command. I will not complain. And... Thank you. This conversation got weird. Yeah. Whatever. Let's get going. And thanks again, everybody. All right. Hell yeah. That's all I wanted is the redemption arc. That is all I wanted is the redemption arc for, for Dar. Because you brought up butts. Thank you, Ajna. <clears throat> Whoa! 
Wash yourselves, outsiders. What did I do? Huh? We're not doing anything yet. Rosme. Rosme. Shush. <laughs> Make sure you tread lightly. This area is under the Iron Kingdom's control, and we won't hesitate to jail any dissidents. Like you took my breath. Shh, Kadira. Who? Us? To see what? <laughs> nah, we're just casual. I've got my eye on you. How? That was close. Keep it cool, will you? I'm sorry. I just hate them so much. You see the lady in red back there? That's the whole character we get. That's the character we get to use. Like, actually, I was actually just about to say, Cloud Stripe looking motherfucker, and then... <sighs> Hold on. I have to save a screenshot. I have, save I have to save a screenshot before I get too distracted. Because I, I now need to save that screenshot to, sa to share with the internet. Let's see, go into my shit post folder. Rosby step. Boop. Okay, I saved my picture. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Curry fish. You know, that's probably not the weirdest combination I've ever experienced. Actually, random aside. You're going to tell me that's a fine you're going to tell me that's a Final Fantasy uh, reference as well. I just don't know if his name is Crump. Now your comment makes sense. God damn it, Gaia. Gaia? We're having words later. <laughs> uh... Anyway, so I was going to tell you something. So, over the weekend, over the weekend, I went out and I hung out with friends over the weekend, did stuff. That's not what I'm here to talk about. I'm talking about, the, I'm talking about food because that's the topic of subject right here. We went out to a place that's in a, a small chain, but that, that a small chain is in, the, uh, in this area called Aaron Snug Pub. E-R-I-N. Aaron. It's an Irish... It's an Irish themed eatery with bar. And oh my gosh, the stuff I got there this weekend, I got there and got the, hi Renji. The stuff I got there and got to eat this weekend was the best. We had scotch eggs, which are hard boiled eggs. They're hard boiled eggs put inside of sausage like uh, sausage meat, and then that's deep fried to fully cook uh, every, the whole thing. 
and then they're cut in half and served in halves with a little bit of honey mustard and a sweet pickle on top. I also had the shillelagh, which is a spring roll with corned beef, some kind of cheese, and peppers in it. And my meal was the Reuben mac and cheese, which is a layer of corned beef, a layer of sauerkraut, mac and cheese that's made with Swiss that's made with Swiss cheese, so cheddar cheese, with garlic rye toast on the side. Strange ass food combinations. Most delicious meal I had in my life. Well, and the, and the most recent few years, I should say. So many puppies! And then there's Roti behind me. Roti, the superhero ant anteater. Yep. Roti. <laughs> I want to recruit you. Can I recruit you yet? Okay, so Crump is a reference to Cloud. This guy is just straight up called Ultima. I can't place Chell, but Dancer. Bard. I don't have money to give you. Can I talk to you people up there? You, hello? Hello? Okay. I'll get back to you in a minute. Okay. You'll never be tough like me as I proceed to turn into a demon. Hi. Nice. I've only got the digital version. I'll be the judge of that. Help. Okay, that's just your name is just straight up not Usagi, but let's go. Good night, Gaia. And I'm probably gonna head off to bed as soon as I get through most of this port town because I do have to. Even though I'm not going to work until later, I am. I still have to go get up at a decent time.
This city is amazing. Oh! That was my goal. I'm making it my goal anyway. Wait, I ran past... I did! I ran past... I almost ran past that thing. Phantom hat. Oh, I can't go back there. Wow, I am actually really gotta explore. Hello. Oh, the helpful guy. I put another person in my head. Oh, it's gonna drive me mad. I know this is the character. This is the guy. I tr I don't want to find out his name beforehand. Uh, Rise. There we go. <laughs> wow. All right. Uncle Scooter's got to save another image real quick. Hold on. Give me just a minute to get my work done. Listen, I find images to save just because it's awesome to see this kind of stuff. Well, apparently I have to be on the look for Shovel Knight. All right, see you later. Well, I can't reach that, so talk to the puppy. Oh, what the story back there is? Hello. Okay, so I don't think I could have blown up that gate before anyway, so that confirms that. Hello. Oh, I can go on these, okay. 
platform gun. This is a little weird. I hit it. There's a save point just up ahead, so I can... I really can't get up higher, can I? God damn, but like, even the background characters are so lively in this game. Like, all that out there. Oh my goodness. Well, I just wanted to... Puppy! I wanted to see hi. So many good puppies. Well, there's the cats. I hope everybody's happy now. Puppies just... Puppies just strewn about with people. Cats. They want... They... The cats. They're here for the food. Oh. Hey, I need a boat. I gotta go somewhere. Somewhere else. Wish I could help you. There's no boats. What? Why? Iron Kingdom won't allow it. They got everything on lockdown. <sighs> what jerks. That ain't the half of it. They've been taking over cities left and right, but Marifa is a port town. Free and independent, you understand. It's always been that way. Now, the Iron Kingdom has set up a blockade around the whole place. No boats going out, no trade, no supplies coming in. What are you gonna do? Wait it out, I guess. The Iron Kingdom sent over some elite forces. There's not much we can do against them. But we don't have time to wait. Uh, I guess you'd be from out of town. And if that's the case, you managed to get here through the Almuta Desert, so you must be made of pretty strong stuff. Yeah, my stuff is tough. Then maybe what you want to do is head to the Tower of Wisdom. It's the tallest building in the port. You can't miss it. There's an old battle axe of an oracle living there. She might know some way out of this predicament. Tower of Wisdom, huh? That helps a lot. You know, you're smarter than you look, old man. Of course. Yeah, I wasn't always a dog hand, you know. I used to be a beekeeper. Oh, that explains it. Right? Yeah. What? This is definitely Princess Remedy. Maybe not. Hello. Anyway. I think that's a good good space to good spot to end things off on for tonight. So, did anybody have any questions before I end off this evening stream?